How's it going guys? Today I'm going to be doing an unboxing of Joker on Blu-ray. This is the standard release that came out everywhere. Didn't bother to go for the 4K. Um, not a huge fan of Steelbooks, so I didn't get that. And I know Target did their Digipacks. Usually it has some awkward packaging and I usually skip those. Not sure if Walmart had anything, but they always include some random card or toy that's kind of unnecessary. So just standard. I thought would just be just fine so we'll be taking a look at this and also checking out if there's any special features so if we take a look at the slip cover this is what it looks like and we have the spine the back and then same cover art same background in the back and um, Everything's the same. Um, so let's go ahead and open it up. So when we open this up, we get our digital code, obviously. And then on the inside, we have our DVD and Blu-ray. Um, I do like this green color. They always make the DVDs look better than the Blu-rays for some reason. We get a, either a standard black or a standard blue. Uh, whatever. Uh, so, yeah. So... That is it for the inside basic packaging. Let's actually look at uh, the inside. Yeah, we got this type of packaging. Not a fan. They're trying to save money on plastic and um, not the best protection for your discs. So let's go ahead and pop this baby into the Blu-ray player and check out what we're getting. Take a look at what's included, special features, um, what different uh, language settings there are, stuff like that. So uh, let's go ahead. All right, so we are on our main menu here. Um, odd choice to have that bar running on the right-hand side. Haven't even reached the scene selection yet, and it's already listing all the scenes there on the side. Um, but let's take a look at this. Um, so, for audio, we have English and Dolby Atmos, just the standard Dolby Digital descriptive audio, um, French, Spanish, and Portuguese. As for subtitles, eh, we just have it in French, Spanish, and Portuguese. For the special features, we have, uh, let's see, just four features, Becoming Joker, Joker Vision and Fury, Please Welcome Joker, and Joker, A Chronicle of Chaos. Now I've looked at all of these four before I started recording, and sadly we only have about 30 minutes worth of special features on here. Um... I believe the, what was it, the first one is about 23 minutes long or something like that, and the rest are really short. So, not a whole lot in the special features department, which is really shocking, because there is enough room on this disc to have more special features. Why there's only 30 minutes worth, just, I don't get it. Um, but this film is a really great film, I really enjoyed it, it's in my top 5 best films of 2019, so it's still worth a pickup. Just, if you're expecting to have a lot of special features, that's not happening. The features are all the same, whether it doesn't matter which exclusive you get, whether it's 4K, Blu-ray, you know, the Target exclusive, Walmart exclusive. So, sadly, we just don't have enough special features here. That just happens with some Blu-rays. Um, some Blu-rays give you, like, three hours worth of special features, and others just have the footage, just didn't put the time and effort to add more for some reason. So... That about concludes my unboxing of Joker um, on Blu-ray. So if you have any comments, thoughts, please comment them down in the comment section. And hit that subscribe button and that like button down below to see more content similar to this. And I'll see you guys next time for more unboxings, reviews, and movie news.